This is Brandon from Watches on You. Today we're going to be taking a look at possibly one of the most unique products made by any watch company that I've seen. But before I start this review, I just wanted to give a quick thank you to Merlin and Alexandra from Nomos USA for sending us this piece. So now let's dive right in. So as you can see, the Nomos sundial, and this is the stainless steel version, there's also a gold plated version which looks really really cool, and it comes in this beautiful, very small box. And it's made of similar material to any uh, Nomos watch that we've seen. Um, and it's very, very nice. I mean, it's very small because it's, oh, it's only a ring. Uh, and an interesting fact, this is actually Nomos's most affordable piece that they make. And it is only $185, but it has a lot of functionality to it. And it's very, very interesting. So here's the ring. It, as I said, is made out of stainless steel. And it looks quite just simple and minimalist like any other Nomos product, but the way it works is just very, very fascinating. So I'll kind of go through how it works and uh, just basically all the features of it right now. So as you can see, there are these letters on the side of the ring itself that represent the months. So right now it is March, so you can see, sorry I had it upside down there, you can see the M right here next to A for April and F for February. And it's about March 20th here, so we will move that to just before April, to the April position. Now, the little dot here lets in the sunlight so that a dot, or sorry, the little hole here lets in sunlight so that a dot will appear on the inside of the ring where if you can see, there are also little numbers on the inside. And it gives the time in military time, so you can actually, it's it's like, uh, so obviously 1 through 24. And it is pretty interesting and actually really accurate. So now I'll meet you guys outside so we can see this piece in action. Okay, so here is the Nomo sundial in action. And as you can see, the time that is currently displaying on this is about 1630, which is obviously 430. And we can actually have another watch here to verify the accuracy of that time. So as you can see, this beautiful Seiko 5 is displaying the time as 526. Now, it's an hour off just because of daylight savings time, but I was very impressed when I saw this. Uh, they obviously did a very good job with the precision manufacturing of the ring. So now let's bring it back inside for my closing remarks on this piece. Okay, so that was the Nomo Sundial in action. Now, I just wanted to make some closing remarks about the functionality of this piece, and I'm sure many of you are wondering, what happens if I'm in a totally different uh, time zone from you, uh, meaning me doing the review? So, as you guys can see, this ring has, it says, sorry if I find it here, it says Chicago on the outside of the ring, sorry, it was covered up by the cord there, and Basically, this is the Chicago version of the ring. Depending on where you are in the world, they have different versions, which are obviously calibrated for the different sun positions that are there. Um, and I think that's pretty cool. It's One problem with that is that if you go to a different time zone, your Nomos ring won't work. Although I have seen people online manually adjust theirs to sort of compensate for that change in time zone. Um, and so I guess you could do that, but it might be a little bit difficult. Either way, this this is only $185, which is a lot cheaper than any of Nomos's other pieces. Uh, but, I mean, it's not like their other pieces are unreasonably priced. They are uh, mechanical, whereas this is more um, obviously not mechanical. It's probably the least, it's the least complicated timekeeping device. Uh, but one other thing that I'd like to mention before I close this video up is that this can actually be worn as either a ring or a necklace. Obviously, it comes on this leather cord here. It's actually made out of goat leather, and Nomos is pretty much... They're pretty well known for their exotic leathers. Their watches come on horse leather straps, which are... I mean, that's obviously very interesting, and they're very comfortable. This cord's obviously also very comfortable and very durable. Um, and it can be easily untied again to wear it as a ring. Although, with this uh, little part, that might become difficult as a ring because depending on how you close your fingers it might kind of intrude on that um but either way i think this is a very very interesting sort of item 
and it's very, very accurate and useful, actually, much more than I thought it would be. Uh, so if you like this video, please remember to subscribe and share. I'll be leaving a link in the description if you want to purchase this piece or learn more about it. Thank you.